Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, we're heading into Willow on Nightmare. So we're getting back to Nightmare, I had spent a couple games on Professional. Now as I get in here, I do want to, once again, I swear I don't know if I hear things, I do once again want to talk about Halloween. This year, I am going to be focusing on Halloween entirely, because, I mean, this whole last year of my channel, I've been just kind of enjoying as the year goes on. I mean, I did an entire Sons of the Forest playthrough, but now that Halloween's come back around and the console update's coming out sometime, this is this Halloween, hopefully, I'm going to be focusing totally on this game this year and this Halloween. There are other games I want to play, and like all the other ghost hunting games and like Mortuary Assistant, stuff like that, so there are other games I would want to play around Halloween, but this year it's going to be all about Phasmophobia, because I really haven't done a lot of Phasmophobia on this channel as much as I want to. So, but next year maybe we'll do some other games. It really just depends on where we are next year. Oh my god, spine on the bed. Now, again, I've walked into the house, and maybe it's because I'm talking. I haven't heard anything, but we did have a good hiding spot there in the garage. I'm happy with that. And again, it's sunrise, so I gotta deal with the temperatures like that. Oh, oh, okay, well, I guess we found a sign of the ghost. Are you here? That definitely does not start out of place like that. Mark Brooks, give us a sign. Okay, I heard that. But what was it? Was it this shoe? I guess it was. Oh yeah, okay, there we go. And also I saw that, EMF-5. We're getting pretty lucky with the EMF-5s. Okay, I'm happy with that then. So I'll tell you what, Mark. Let me turn this light on and maybe some other ones. Let me just get, like, my path. I'm very happy with this setup. The ghost is far away from the hiding spot. We have uh, all the way back there we can get to. So I'm going to drop my items. We already know where the bone is. No, I don't think I got the cursed item. I didn't see the Ouija board in there. But I'm going to go ahead and drop my stuff. Alright, well, we already got one of the two evidences with the EMF-5. I don't think my sanity's gone too low. Now, the objectives are easy, but I might have to get hunted here to find out the ghost. That's, like, the whole point of Nightmare. So, I'm gonna get other evidence in there just to see what we get. I, uh, I, I'm okay with the sanity right now, but I guess at some point I'm gonna want to bring in smudge sticks and <laughs> sticks and crucifixes. Well, maybe I brought in the other evidence. We can figure that out right away. Okay, I heard that. Let me put the book down. Are you here? Since you are nearby, I'll talk to you. Are you friendly? Now, I kind of want to see the EMF on that. Yeah, you're still back in this corner. Where are you? Maybe you moved that laptop. Are you friendly? Oh, where are you? Alright, I didn't bring in the UV, unfortunately. There, my camera's right in front of me. There. Maybe I'll hold the camera on me. Let me leave that on. Let me do the last evidence I can scan for. Mm. Breaker's on, and it's not even really cold, so yeah, god, if it's freezing, might want to have to turn that breaker back off again. Alright, you are touching that door. Oh, wow! For once, you give me writing pretty early. That never happens. So, look at that. EMF 5 ghost writing. Spirit shader miling. Okay, miling. I have to remember again. Yeah, hmm quieter when hunting, so this would be a good time to test that, but if the only other evidence is spirit or shade, well the shade I could tell pretty easily. If it hunts from the same room as me, it's not a shade. And now I also could smudge and see if it doesn't hunt for three minutes to see if it's a spirit. Now, I'm, here's what I really should do. The miling has been like the one ghost I've had a hard time learning, and it's it makes... Well, let me read about it again. Yeah, quieter when hunting, so you will hear the footsteps before you hear the ghost moaning noise. So I need to try and figure that out if mm, this is a miling. But we got the two evidences. I could get a perfect game here, so we'll see what happens with photos. But maybe I should just try and regroup back at the truck. Actually, I see this door here. I have my headlight on. Let me run downstairs. See if it's this summoning circle, which it is. Alright, I don't even want to hang out down here. I don't know if I'm even going to need that. I might have to, to do, or to use it to get a hunt. 
I don't know uh, what if it's a shade. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to use it. All right, let me run outside. The ghost didn't do anything. Okay, so the plan is get crucifixes in there because I I don't think it's draining my sanity a lot, especially if it's a shade. Now, paramic sound could happen in motion sensor, so maybe we could get those out of the way. Motion sensor, paramic. I'm gonna get the crucifix in there first because I don't think it's about to hunt, but I just want to have the crucifix in there just to give me an idea of when it's you know in range of hunting. I don't think any of these ghosts are early hunters though. Well, especially not the shade. It's just gonna have to come down to if we can figure out if it's the miling sounds or really the smudge with the spirit could be a good way if it doesn't hunt for three minutes instead of the minute and a half. Oh, okay. I'm gonna put that dead center. It is cold in here now, but doesn't really matter. Hmm, where should I put this? Eh, I don't like that. Okay, that's good enough if you roam into the room. So, yeah, give me another photo. Alright, looking good there. Maybe I'll have to get in the salt at some point. Give us a sign. You're flashing lights out there. Last time I had a shade, it was a dead giveaway. Okay, thank you. That it hunted and never gave me a ghost event. Also, this one is not giving me a ghost event. But it did do some interactions around me, so it doesn't feel entirely like a shade. It is walking through here. Just a pair of mic sound now. I'm gonna throw my camera down. I don't think I'll need it. So this will really determine. Oh, you know what? Miling, right? It just said <laughs> milings make more paranormal sound. Okay, well maybe this is a miling then, because it just gave me the paranormal sound. All right, I'm, I'm at least putting in miling for now. Let's actually sit here and see if we get more. I actually kind of forgot that I read it right there. It even, well yeah, my, milings make more paranormal sounds. So let's actually get some use out of this new tier two. Mike. I mean, I got the one instantly there. It'd be nice to get maybe a chain of them to make me think you're miling. Well, yeah, I guess I will be draining my sanity at least with the uh, summoning circle. I'm going to be draining sanity first. Maybe this is a miling. Because it can take a while to get a voice. But let's sit here for a little bit longer and just keep kind of determining it by that. I'm covering that whole room, and it hasn't thrown anything. Oh, dude, this is a miling. Okay. There's no way with all these paranormal sounds. If you sit on a paramic, you never get sounds like this. I still need to get a hunt just to see if I can tell the miling footsteps, though. But I'm very confident this is a miling. I'm going to get one more. <laughs> There's the motion sensor. I'm going to try and get one more here. So, yeah, the duration... It's only been less than a minute and a half of using this thing and I've gotten three sounds. That's ridiculous. Maybe I will need to go get a smudge though here in a second. I really don't think my sanity's draining. Oh my god. Okay, yes. This is definitely a miling. I'm putting this thing away. We got four in less than two minutes. Okay, so yeah. The main thing here is me trying to figure out the miling and just hearing the footsteps before the sound, so... I don't know, this will be interesting. I'm going to get smudges. I'm actually going to take the crucifix out. So that way, maybe I'll not get hunted out here. Let's put this all the way here so that way I know the ghost won't hunt from that line. Okay, I'm gonna go get more supplies to survive this. Yeah, I've never had a ghost that didn't talk that much to the pair of mic. This is obviously a miling now, so. I mean, it's nice that the miling can give you that without having to hear the hunt sound, so I was always afraid of hearing a miling or determining a miling because this has just been a problem I've had is trying to figure out the sounds during a hunt. But with the paramic thing, it really does another dead giveaway of a miling. Okay, <laughs> we're doing good on otherwise. So, maybe one thing of salt and two smudges and then the lighter. So the plan is, get mm, how many salt photos do I need? Well, I need four photos in total. So maybe I can get three salt and something else. Mm, I don't really want to drop anything. I'm going to put these through here. Now I can drop that. Give us a sign. Maybe I'll get a ghost photo here. Oh, okay. Well, let me take that. I still see that shoe over there. My god, again, right on top of me. Oh, how is that 
Maybe because it was half in the bed. Is that still gonna be two star? It's because it's like half under the bed. Oh well. So no more deleting photos. <laughs> okay, that's gonna have to leave the room now. Okay, well there's a good thing to note. Don't put the salt underneath half the cover there. Well, I'm, the next thing I'm gonna have to go do, I, maybe I don't even care about photos here. I mean, this ghost is acting like a shade. Give us a sign. Maybe my sanity is still pretty high. Can these pillows be thrown? That'd be cool if it could. That'd be just another thing for. I think maybe the pillows can be, can be thrown on Point Hope. Okay. Mm hmm. There's a photo. Come on, just two more. Oh, okay, just one more. It really sucks. I mean, you're right next to the salt. Maybe you could just go through that. Also, I'm, mm, I'm gonna try and leave my headlight off. I really have a hard time to keeping track if that's on or not. Do you want to do something else? Come on, give us a sign. You haven't- you've really been acting like a shade. You haven't done anything. Give us a sign, come on. What's this ghost's name again? Mark Brooks. You're supposed to be able to anger the ghost with its name, but who knows how much it actually works. Okay, Mark, come on, we need one more photo here. Oh, I can't take a photo of that, unfortunately. I can't believe he hasn't left the room, though. I keep hearing little weird little noises. I don't know if it's actually something getting thrown. Oh, wow, look at that. Mm, neat little light. Come on, Mark, are you over here? No, you're over here. Okay, one more sign, Mark. I kind of appreciate that you haven't left the room. I wonder if I should, like, mess with some stuff in here. I don't think I have an inventory spot. I'm gonna throw my other smudge out here. Come on, Mark, play with this ball or something. I'm gonna try and throw it across the room. Come on, Mark, hit that ball. You really haven't touched anything, thrown anything? Oh, now you're running out the door. Will that be a three star? Okay, there we go. Book is filled. Got the objectives. So, I'm going to... I don't even want a photo, do I? I just need to get hunted. Oh, why are you roaming out here? This is not good. Did you just throw something in here? Well, oh no, you threw this. Yeah, it's roaming out in the hallway. Finally, he left the room. Okay, do I... Try, I don't think I'm gonna have to take sanity before trying to get a hunt from the summoning circle. So maybe I do that to try and get as long of a hunt as possible so that way I can try and hear. So yeah, let me go take pills and then I'll come back in and summon, summon the ghost with the circle. Wow, okay, I could take almost all of them. Or maybe I could take all of them because I can't take any of the bottles, so Jesus, how low was I really? All right, yeah, just running back in here with the full thing of smudge sticks. I don't really know if I'll need them. Oh man, I do have them. They're all the way back here. I don't know if I'm gonna need one back in the hiding spot, but just for safety. I am going to try to escape the ghost, but maybe I'll just smudge it out here. Okay, again, keeping track. Now, I don't need a photo of the ghost and it's not gonna do anything for me, so. Oh my god. Why is the light switch all the way down here for this basement? Alright, again, all we gotta do... Just go ahead and light this up. <laughs> Say hello to the ghost! And now- Oh my god, my headlight again. So I'm actually gonna- No, don't- Okay, just leave that off. I want him to see me. I don't know how I wanna do this, actually. Let me- Yeah, he'll see me if he comes up here. Let me just walk over here, then. Okay, now I'm gonna- I need to actually be quiet here, so let me listen. I hear both. Well, he's awful close now. I mean, it's- It's a small map, so it's really hard to tell. But I mean, the- the entire time I'm hearing both footsteps and the moaning. 
It's very maybe it's because it's willow. It's so hard to tell. But yeah, that's the thing about mylings, and that's why they're like the hardest for me to determine. But hey, maybe it's not a myling. I mean, that's every possibility. Okay, now that we're let's see if it's a shade. Well, uh, we smudged it, so let me look at the timer. Okay, it's 16:30. I'm gonna see if, if it hunts again. But if it hunts, I oh my god. I actually don't think it's a myling now, huh? because maybe, you know, the way I didn't hear it. Do I drain my sanity? I mean, my sanity's already gone. Oh god, I'm on top of the bed. Wait, what? I just heard you do a light switch. That's so weird. Sometimes I hear a double light switch. Now you are in here. Did you turn on the... Oh, you did... What is going on with this ghost? It's turning on lights. It's turning them back off. If it's in this room and it's a shade, it's not going to hunt. That's one thing I want to determine. I'm going to see when it's been a minute and a half. Okay, now we're like, I'm not convinced it's a myling, even though it gave me through four paranormal sounds. I'm going to stay behind a... What? Another EMF-5. So I have two smudges on me. Oh my god, finally you interact with this computer. I almost forget that this is even interactable. Wow, that also blinded me from looking at all those. So, okay, ghost event. That was two ghost events, so maybe you're not a shade. Okay, by the way, we're definitely past a minute 30. So, if it doesn't hunt for another minute 30, then it's probably a spirit. I, I thought I was getting away with this easy with the myling, but I don't think this is a myling. Because I think even on Willow, I would have heard it at some point, but maybe not. It seems like a shade, because... Well, I, it smu we smudged it, so... Give it another minute. And then if it hunts, it's... This is a spirit. Uh, right now, I'm saying this is a spirit. Because... It has hunted. Like, I'm at zero sanity. This thing should have hunted again. Now, if it's a shade... Maybe it's a shade, because we're in the same room with it. Okay, again, this is not as easy. He was right on top of me. Okay, well, n not a shade. <laughs> yeah, you go down there. I'm gonna say not a shade, because it hunted in the exact same room. Now, maybe it was a myling, because that was not... I don't. I didn't exactly determine the three minutes, but that was before what I was gonna say was the three minutes. But again, I didn't, and that might be really close. That might be a really close spirit hunt. Let me listen. I don't know. I gotta like look into the miling again. I don't. I think this is a spirit. Okay, so that's the thing. I should have looked when I smudged, because it's been another like 30 seconds probably. See, I can do another test by waiting another three minutes or a minute and a half just to see if it hunts again. I oh, okay, well. I hate to like guess, but now you're really smudged. I'm gonna give it another minute and a half, okay? And then, if it hunts... Okay, Jesus Christ. I'm at 20 minutes in the recording. If it doesn't hunt until 23, then it's definitely a spirit. I'm going to wait this out one last time. I don't have a smudge, so maybe I should actually go back. Look at how dark it is in here. Please open these doors again. I'm kind of getting really thrown here. It's not a shade, we know that much. Let me turn off my light. So... I mean, I know it's a small map, so it's hard to tell the myling ability during a hunt, but the fact, like, I didn't exactly keep track of the time there right with the spirit, so it really feels like that could have been a really close spirit hunt. Like, I think it was right after three minutes, because I didn't really do a good job of keeping track. I smudged, and then way later on, I started keeping the timer. So I have one smudge. Maybe we just get the other crucifix in there. All right, I'm going to go back in. And we've spent a little bit longer time, at least. I'm going to see if it hunts. Okay, in 15 seconds, it's officially been a minute 30. So if it hunts... 
It's not any ghost is not gonna hunt until then. But if it doesn't hunt for the next minute and a half, <laughs> it's a spirit. But we have. I'm gonna try not to um, panic smudge. We have the crucifix in here though. What are you doing to me? You're right in front of me, man. Just stay on that computer. See, this is the moments where it feels like a spirit because it's just not doing anything and it's not hunting. The fact that it's not hunting makes it feel like a spirit. I don't know if you, when you smudge it again, does the timer reset again, even if it's already smudged? It probably does. Can I get a cool shot of this dude? Oh my god. Doesn't even matter my sanity at this point. You're standing right on the crucifix. I'm actually going to say, just because I didn't hear the miling, I'm going to say this is a spirit. Yeah. We still have another 30 seconds, and it has not hunted. I'm expecting that crucifix to go off. I'm saying this is a spirit, though. I think last time it, it just used up to three minutes and then hunted. So, yeah, maybe this isn't the day to learn the miling. We'll see, though. Uh, this is another return to nightmare. So that's, again, that's why I want to finally, you know, delve into this game, play it a whole bunch this Halloween, this month, and also, like, just in November into December into the the holiday, which I'm hoping Bleasdale and Grafton will come with the holiday update, but maybe that's just me being hopeful. But again, I'm sticking with this game. There's always going to be this game on this channel. By the way, this is a spirit. This is definitely a spirit, because it's not hunted in three minutes. And it's not a shade, because it already hunted in the same room with me. Maybe it is a shade. This is not a hiding spot. It, mm -hmm. See, now it's wanting me... No, it already hunted in the same... It's... It hunted on top of me. This is a spirit. So once this hunt's over, I'm gonna run out of here. It just happened to hunt outside of the room, but that... Please don't make me smudge. It would be so good if you just didn't check your own room right here, dude. But this is gonna be a cursed hunt. I don't know how you aren't checking your own room right now. That's what you get for hunting somewhere else. I'm, I'm not going to say that's a shade from that. I got to listen. Okay, dude, we are officially leaving now. So I'm going to say it's a spirit because of how long it took to hunt again from the two smudges. Both those smudges took a real long time. And again, I never heard the miling ability, but even though we're on a really small map, maybe the ghost wasn't far enough away to hear the miling ability. So, I don't know. I'm going with spirit. Maybe this is just a good old spirit on Nightmare. Again, we heard the paramic sounds. Let's see. It was a spirit. That's crazy. The spirit really tried to throw me off like that. I had the, I had only three ghosts it could have been. Well, that was weird. It lagged. I thought the perfect investigation was 164. All right, look at that. Tier 3 UV, which I don't even know if I'll use. I'll use it for fun, but I still think the glow stick is basically the tier 3 UV. But 1900 on a small map, and that feels pretty good. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.